as you've developed these, there have to have been some surprises that uh, you anticipated one phenomenon to occur and something else occurred that led you to another solution. What were the surprises as you've developed these processes? I think the, um, the surprises were um, the fact that you can uh, generate a, enough patents to actually spend on a company. Um, I think the, <clears throat> the surprise that people would actually invest in the company. Um, you know, we, we were able to get emerging technology funds for, one of the, for actually both of the companies that were performed here in Texas, so I was surprised that we were successful at doing that. Um, the, the surprise that you could actually hire your own graduate students into the company um, and maintain these personal relationships with them over the years. Um, so all those, I, I've always been surprised that we actually got as far as we did because really, the, again, the original motivation was just to, um, in, in a time of very difficult uh, grant access, because grants are so competitive, you know, having an alternative route uh, to fund your research has been very surprising. I mean, we, we still apply for competitive grants at NIH um, and the American Heart, and we've been successful as, as groups of researchers getting those grants, but I think I've always been very surprised that what was just an idea of a, an alternative way to get funding for research, you know, actually resulted in companies and in products.